What's going on, guys? And welcome back to another episode of Ark Astraos. Last we left off, we tamed this protoceratops named Runt, as well as Kratos, our Pachyranos or Pachyranosaurus, Dilophosaurus. We also tamed up the Moss Chops. It finally wanted something other than honey. It wanted a Medjo Berry, I do believe, so we managed to get the moss chops, which means fiber gathering is now a whole lot easier. We've got 14 levels, I'm going all into weight, so you can carry a lot of stuff. We haven't named the moss chops yet. I might name you, what gender are you? You are a female, all right? So we've got a female you, male, male. So in today's episode, what I'd like to do is get some trank arrows and an and a bow ready. So we could tame up that Parasaur. If that 140 Parasaur is still there, I'd love to tame it. And then I'd like to get a Raptor as well. That would be super beneficial. If we can get a Raptor this episode, that would be great. So we got the Mortar and Pestle. We just need to make some Narcotic. Alright, so let me pick up some... What was that in the water? Let me just pick up uh, any Medjo Berries or... No, sorry, Narco Berries from you. You only have 900 health. Let's get up to 200 health with you. And then maybe some stamina, like a bunch of stamina, and then put the rest in the weight. Alright, you're on a sugar rush, it looks like. Alright, you have Narco Berries for days, Miss Moss Chops, ma'am. So let's go ahead and maybe round up all the spoiled meat we may have. We've got 10 in our inventory. Do we have any on the Dilophosaur? We do not. What about on the Moss Chops? Nope. Alright. Looks like 10 narcotic it is. For now. That should be enough for the Parasaur anyway. We need to make some stone arrows as well. That's another thing we need to make. Alright. I think we can have... I think we can get thatch and wood from the... Yeah, we got plenty of thatch. Can we get wood from the Moss Chops? Okay, we can. Good. We're not really going to get an awesome spyglass just yet. I mean, if I find some crystal, we can get some awesome spyglass going, but for right now, let's just get whatever we need. So, no, wait, it's flint we need. We need flint for the stone arrows. Oh, yeah, we do need wood for the bow. We do need some wood for the bow. So, let's go ahead and make ourselves a bow. And we should be good to go. I just came back from my trip to Maine. It's beautiful up there. It really is. It's It was a lot of fun. Though I'm sorry. Massachusetts is my home. But now that I'm back in Massachusetts, I'm able to record videos again. It's it's awesome. It's a good time. Alright, we should have more than enough hide now. Let's... Okay, we got 21 levels. Let's go up into health a bit. Get that up to 10k. Maybe get the weight up to 1,000 if we can. Alright, there's the Parasaur we're wanting. So what I'm going to do is hunt down this Parasaur. I'm going to go on foot, get some bolas, and we should be good to go. Alright, let's see. Hide. Alright, bola. We can make two of those. Alright, better than nothing anyway. And we'll use the second one for the Raptor. That should be good enough for a 130? Was or What are you, a 130? I think you are. 135, alright. That should be good enough. We're gonna keep getting headshots up in here. And down goes our friend. Awesome. Wait, what's your trait? Giant slaying, alright. Don't really know what these genes do. I mean, I could look them up and do some research, but... You know what, it's whatever. Alright, so what I'll do... I will, um, tame up this Parasaur, and I'll see you guys in a little bit when he's fully tamed. And there we have it. Parasaur has been tamed. At a level 202. We can't really see your stats at the moment, because, you know, you're just... We don't have the Spyglass at the moment, nor do we have the Soul Trap mod. Or, well, we do, but we don't have the, uh, the Dino Ball thing on us at the moment. So let's just... Get back to base. Make a saddle for the Parasaur. Parasaurs are not the greatest swimmers, but you would think since they're Hadrosaurs, they'd be really good swimmers. There's an Oviraptor. Perfect. 
kill you. Or are you just gonna run away? Yeah, you're just gonna run away. You're a 130, of course you are. Great, out of stamina, wonderful. Alright, follow me. Alright, we got him, we got him. Ouch. Did not mean to hit you then. But you managed to get hide. Awesome, we got enough hide so we can get the Parasaur saddle. And then we're gonna do some exploring. I think that's the goal here. Explore the map a little bit. Alright, follow me back. We got five levels. We'll worry about that in a minute. Morning is approaching, which is awesome. Perfect timing. Because we're about to take the Parasaur out for a spin. This was our purple Parasaur, I do believe. Alright, you can stay there. Alright, we can move a lot faster. We should have more stamina. Let's go exploring. I want to see what's going on. Like, I want to see if we can get a raptor or something. So we at least have, like, something fast. That's kind of my goal, really. A raptor would be cool. What else might be cool is, uh, maybe, uh... Pteranodon might be cool, too, because we can fly around the map. I was gonna say, I thought the game was crashing for a minute. No, it's just rain. While we're out and about, we'll see if we can get some metal, so we can get some metal tools and maybe some crystal for the digitizer and the, uh, what's it called, the spike? That is an Antrodemus. Oh, God, run. Let's go this way. Get up there. That was an Antrodemus. Right off the bat. Oh, God! That's definitely an Antrodemus. Alright, hide behind the rock. Please don't spot me. I think he spotted me. Oh, crap. Jump in the water. Jump in the water! It's our only way to survive. Okay, all right. We're not going that way. That's, that is a no-go. Yeah, we're decent at swimming. Not the greatest, but we can swim. We can definitely swim. I swear to God, if that thing followed us all the way down here, I'm going to be very annoyed. I was not expecting to see an Antrodemus up there. Certainly wasn't expecting that. There's a Diamantinosaur. That's pretty awesome. I don't even know what level that Antrodemus is, nor do I care. Okay, we can take a Dillo. We can take a Dillo. Level 90. We do 295 damage. Better than nothing. Let's see if we can get our melee up. Because we kind of want you to be kind of a fighter, but not much of a fighter. Like, how much damage do we do now? That's a 140 female. We could have we could have had a breeding pair, but you know what? Whatever. I'm hoping we find a raptor. That That's kind of our goal for today's episode. Those are Trudons. That's a beautiful Trudon. I'm sure we could take that. I'm sure we could take that. Let's get our melee up a bit. Is it me or does the Trudon look a little big? That's a 95. 233. You're also a 95. Alright. How much hide do we have in our inventory? 87? What up, Trike? How you doing? Yeah, that is a beautiful Troodon. Baby Troodons are a thing. So. Oh, hello, Trike. Alright. Um. Okay. You are a beautiful Trike, though. A little of you. 95, you do have a baby. It says you have a baby. I think that pink thing is a Pego. Yeah, there's a couple of Pegos. I really don't want to deal with a Pego right now. I did not miss Pegos from Aberration. They don't spawn an Aberration. Thank God they don't spawn an Aberration. There's a Pteranodon there. If we could get a level on that Pteranodon, that might be nice. Those Pegos won't be an issue if we just keep running. 
Let's go this way. You know, let's save the game, just in case, and we'll go this way. Yeah, we're kind of exploring the map a little bit, which is cool. Game, thank you. Alright, let's go up into wait a little bit and then put the rest in the melee. Alright, we're getting into dangerous territory. I do see an Argentavis. That's a Carno. Run, run. Is it chasing us? Okay, I... I... Yeah, it's, it's sauce. It spotted us. I'd rather not take fall damage. Run. Run from the Carno. Run from the Carno. Run from the Carno. Luckily, we are able to outrun it, which is awesome. Let's go around the Dillos. Try to avoid any conflict, if possible. Okay. The only reason we look so bloody is because we leveled up a bunch. There's the beach. I don't know if we're going to find a raptor in the beach. Oh, there's like some boats here. Oh, Pego, piss off. I mean, even if we don't find a raptor, we'll probably be able to find, like... Oh, we got a camel here. Wait, I can shoot off the back of a camel, couldn't I? Those are, like, passive tames. I think they're passive tames. There's a Nothosaurus. That would be really good. Nothosaurus are really good. You know, they're... They're very versatile. You can shoot off the back of them. They're very easy to tame. Let me see what this is all about. Oh, you're a nice color, too. What will you? 25? Oh, that's a shame. You were a very nice color. I'll leave you alone, though. I just want to explore a little bit. What is this? What is this now? I see a Therizino in the distance. This looks like a little village. Whoa. This is cool. This is cool. I could easily build a... You know what? I could build a base here. Anything in this crate, maybe? No? Okay. This is a cool-looking area. There's a lot of these spike things. That's kind of awesome. Look how big the Nothosaurus is compared to the Parasaur. That's pretty... That's pretty insane. What will you... Mr. Sir. That's a max level. Okay, that is a max level Nothosaurus. I will keep you in mind for, like, a future video. So let me mark that down on the map. I think that's a sea dragon right there. Is that an alpha? I think that's an alpha. All right, let me mark this down on the map. I'll keep that as, like, for future reference. Max level Natho. All right, there's got to be a raptor around here somewhere. What is this now? These look like boats. They're ships. Can I get on them? What is this all about? Wow, th this is so cool. This is cool. I gotta admit, there's another boat right there. There's another boat right there. There's one of those sea dragon things down there. I do believe that's an alpha, though. So cool, though. There's a raptor right there. I'd love to see what level you are. I don't have a spyglass on me at the moment. The raptor is after me. There's a baby. What low level are you? That's a 20. You're not worth the while. You're a 20. There's a baby raptor. Level you. 135. That's a 135 raptor. You know, I'm keeping you. I'm keeping We got our raptor, boys. We got our raptor. It's a 135, which is really good. Where this 135 came from, I have no idea. We got a raptor, boys. We got a raptor. Now, part of me wants to go see if we could find some crystal so we can get an awesome spyglass going. Oh, we got a couple calicos. Let's uh, get out of here before those calicos spot us. 
There is a baby calico. I wonder if we'll be able to tame one. Oh, you want an imprint? Do you want to cuddle? Cuddle! You're probably only going to be partially imprinted. Inherit melee robust. Isn't that the one where you get better melee? I think that's what it is. Alright, we don't have an awesome spyglass yet, so we can't check out stats. Alright, what I might do is, like, maybe leave the raptor here. Maybe I'll leave the raptor, like, uh... Or should I get a saddle? Or should I get the raptor a saddle? And then just use the raptor to get about. Okay, you know what we'll do? You know what we'll do? Next episode, we'll go out and get some crystal. So that way there, we can go out and... That's another Diamantinosaur. We can get an awesome spyglass and the digitizer. So that'll make transporting dinos a lot easier. So yeah, that's what we'll do. Alright, so I'll see you guys back at base. And we will go ahead and uh, get a saddle for our raptor. And we should be good to go. Is that a dead carcass? That looks like a dead whale. Alright, seagulls piss off. I don't need you chasing me right now. I really don't need you chasing me right now. I don't know what they stole, nor do I care what they stole. No, that's a Megalodon. Do we get spoiled meat and organic polymer from that? I kind of want to test that out. Okay, you get oil, hide, and spoiled meat from it. You know, the raptor would be really good to harvest this, because... Well, and there goes my hatchet, and we just need one more flint. I feel like traveling on the raptor would be a lot faster. There's a Mesopithecus. There's a couple of Mesopithecus here. Right, let's just keep running. Ignore the Pegos, and they won't bother you. But now the raptors should make it a lot easier to get about. There's a Carno. I think that's the same Carno that chased us. Now it's over here. There's a blue drop. All right. Let's go this way. I don't know why the Parasaur would lead the Carno to us. Raptor, you wait right here. I'm going to go deal with this Carno. Please be a low level. Okay, you were a 20, but you weren't a big deal. All right, Raptor, go get that carcass. There you go. That's a good. That's a good boy. Wait. Are you a male or are you a female? Only one way to find out. You are a male. Okay. All right. You started off with 3,500 health or 1,300 health, which isn't bad. We got some metal anyway. All right. We got a drop. What's in it? Please be something that'll make our life easier. Narcotic? Okay. We've got, like, some narcotic. We've got some wool, I believe that is. Yeah, wool. we got an Apprentice Pachyrhinosaurus saddle, which is, you know, not bad. Let's get that to 2,000. We'll get a saddle for the raptor, and then we should be good to go. We'll test our raptor out, see how good he is, and then we'll, uh... I guess we'll end the episode there. Because we got our raptor, you know... And then next episode, we'll do some more exploration and see what we can do with the raptor. Maybe go get some crystal for an awesome spyglass and whatever. All right, and we're almost at base, and there is a Pteranodon here we could probably try and tame. We didn't even need a bola for the raptor, so now we have an extra bola. That is a beautiful Pteranodon. Damn, there's one right here that landed on the ground. Level you, good sir. If you're a high level, I might tame you. 95? Not the greatest level. You know what? It's... You know what? it on. I... Oh, no. A uh, passive, I meant to say. Passive. I think you're gonna die. The raptor just immediately started attacking you. Alright, he's down. He's down. 
I don't know if we have any crime on us. I don't think we do. No, well, regular meat's gonna have to do for now. I guess we're getting a Tyranodon. That could have been bad. We tried to kill it. Alright. We'll track the Tyranodon. I'll let this guy tame up. We'll get some... We'll get some more hide and whatever to tame the, uh, to get the raptor saddle, and we should be good to go. We'll take our raptor out for a spin. All right, we're back. We got our raptor. All right, let's see what we need. Raptor. We can make a raptor saddle right off the bat. That is awesome. Now let's put some of these resources onto you. We don't need them at the moment. I might take the, the arrows, though. Well, let's test out our raptor, see how good he is. Against this Listro. 145. For a raptor, that's not bad. That is not bad at all. Alright, so our raptor is, uh, I would say, fully imprinted. And he's got 1,500 health and 928% melee. Let me give you some of that narcotic. You're a sprinter, apparently. The Toronto's a sprinter. Alright. We do about 145 damage, or 245 damage, which is really good. Let's get our health up to maybe 10k. And then start putting some points into weight, and then maybe put some points into melee. Alright, I kind of want to see what level this Toronodon is. Hello! Can I see what level you are? 135, of course you are. Screw it. Alright, we put two arrows into it. Will it go down? Only one way to find out. I don't have any bolas on me, so... I guess not. Well, he's flying into the water, so... 135 would have been good. Alright, well, I'll let you guys know when this 95 is fully tamed, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. And there we have it. Level 95 Pteranodon has been tamed, and you are a beautiful color, though. The blue and the... the light blue and the red, that's kind of nice. Pteranodons are really good for early game. Because we have something to fly around on. We can cover the map more efficiently. Of course, we'll still use our raptor for whatever, but yeah, this we'll still use our raptor for right now. We've got the Lystra or the Pteranodon even. Alright, Whistle Flyer Land. Alright, so today was a pretty successful day. We got the Parasaur, we got a Raptor, and we got a Pteranodon. Maybe if that 135 decides to come back, I might tame it. But for now, it's just chilling by the ocean. Alright, so we got a Pteranodon, we got a Raptor, and we got a Parasaur. I'd say it's a pretty good day. Next episode, we'll definitely see if we can get some crystals so we can make the awesome Spyglass, as well as the Dino Balls for the Soul Trap mod. But until then, that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.